Today, we got a world record attempt for the longest suspended soda can chain. The record is 10. If you don't know what that is, it's stacking cans of soda on top of each other, and then you got to hold it up horizontally out and keep it going. 10 cans one guy was able to do to break the record. And this is your idea with your grip in such failing is this the condition? Part, is this the part where you make me feel good about myself? <laughs> You got the eye of a tiger, eh? Yeah. I think this is going to be a different kind of strength than grip strength. I'm, I'm with Kevin on this. Yeah. Thank you, Kevin. Uh huh. But yeah. you do need to use grip. Well, yeah, then with all this, John, I want you. Now it's personal. I hope you have the lowest card. Okay. I got a seven. <laughs> what did you get, Virginia? I got a six. Oh, okay. No. Please, yeah. please. I, wa I want the rich. I want a bad. Okay. Oh, I got a queen. Oh! 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 Good to be, Suits. What did you get? He got a 10, ten. Yes. Oh. in Virginia. All right. Oh, yes. Okay. Let's do this, you bitch-ass grip. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, dude, you can't lose this now. <laughs> Can you imagine? Just, oh, she's not going to shut up if she beats you at this. I know. Oh, I'm probably not no. going to shut up regardless. You can't lose. Um, now, as far as the record goes, I think the ultimate question is how long do you need to hold it? I think probably a standing three count is good. Okay. One, two, three, good. I'm with you. That's and, what you got. And if you you let us know how many attempts you want. If it's just one attempt, it's one attempt. It's one attempt. Okay. What you got? Yeah. When when the cans fall, it's all over. Now in front of you, I see that you have got 12 cans of Coca-Cola. Okay. Yes, I had a whole thing with Cola Wars. I had another 12 pack of Pepsi. It's gonna be doing it at the same time. I left it on top of my little refrigerator area. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you standing like that, Quasimoto? You know why. She's trying to, she's trying to get in my head right now. She knows I'm injured. Yeah, she yeah. knows I'm down and out. She's going in on me. So the two biggest things, strength is going to be a factor. It's also your wingspan, just how far out your hands can go. The record is 10, and you know, it could have been more if the person who broke the Guinness World Record had a longer wingspan. Jaybird should be favored here because he would have a longer wingspan than Virginia would. And his name is Bird. You shouldn't battle a guy named Bird with wingspan. True. <laughs> I'm so afraid I'm going to lose this. You can't lose this. There's, did you I, practice? There's really no way you should lose this. I did not practice. I have no idea like, even how to like do this, but can you go first? I would think what you would do is you would stack up the cans, and then you would slide it off, and then you would have... One hand under your stack of cans, and then you put your other hand on the top, and then you've got to rotate it. So then all those cans go horizontal, and you've got to hold that then for a three count to get it to count. That's my guess. When you, when you go like that, though, you do risk of a nothing because you could do that, and it and all they can could all fall. Just, yeah, and you get a zip. Yeah. And then we would do another attempt. If we get two zips, <laughs> then you do it. Denny's has got them math, where he lays them out. For he's doing yeah. it. I'm yeah. trying that out with the sideways method, starting with 10 sideways. That's not bad it's, call. It's tough, I, though. I did four, and it was heavy. Whoa. So 10 at this this width is going to be very... Okay. So, yeah, it might be better to start with them down. You go on ahead and you build your soda can chain laying on the table, and then you try to pick no, it up from age there. age before beauty. This is your bit. I want to see how you do it so I, I can try to fix your mistakes. Whoever okay. Kevin wants to go first, let him pick. Okay. I... I don't care. Denny's, let's just have Bird go. I mean, she's there. Virginia's going to put up a fight, and it's going to take the bit. You're right. You're right. This will be easy. Right. It's so yeah. annoying. The path right. of less resistance. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay, so Bird is uh, going to take Denny's advice, and I think that is smart. He's Can't got uh, four cans now <laughs> that Jaber doesn't want any help at all. Well, I just I know what's going to happen. Yeah, like so maybe, like, wow, Denny's just helping him. You can't count that. And, and that'll be fun to deal with. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You're, it looks like uh, six see, cans right now. This is where we get into a provocative situation. I think I Let's could, see if you could do it. Well, let's see if you could suspend six cans right now. Okay. This would be a soda can chain. Jaybird has got six cans. He's picking it up on either end. He's got to lift it up for a standing three count for him to get credit for six. Oh, they're wobbling already. This might be a lot tougher than expected. I thought this was going to be pretty easy. I thought we might even come close to beating it. That's oh. not going to count. Six, he cannot do. You're going to have to probably go down to five. How did that guy do ten? Great question. 
All right, so that, 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 does that not count? That doesn't count. That doesn't right. count. But you're going to have to go down to five to do it. Let's see. How do you go down? He's whispering a strategy over to uh, Denny's on doing this. Should we split it into two piles of five and see if either of you guys can do it? I'll see if Burke can do five first. He can't do six. So six is out. Five. Can he suspend five soda cans? Lifting it one. To, oh, no, you got your hand on a, on b two cans on the you inside. Can you do that? I don't think you can. No, can you? What do you think, Denny's? Could you do that? Uh, at least in the video, it seemed like the guy had, had it on, on one hand. hand. On I each think, hand. yeah. I think you're going to call bollocks on that. I, I think you can that. only have a hand on each can on either side. Okay. So that would count Four, right one, there. One, two, three. Okay. Jay Bird has got it at five cans. You are half of the world record. I can do six. I know it. <laughs> okay. You didn't. Virginia gets her shot. She can try six first. For an outright win. If she can't, she can try to match at five. And if she can't do five, then she's going to lose this challenge. Okay, this is the world record attempt for the longest suspended soda can chain. The world record stands at ten. <laughs> Some of these are bent. That would be a big factor because they got to groove nicely together. Now, Virginia's going the other way where she's putting them upright. And then it looks like she's going to try to hold and flip. Oh, wow, they're bent. But you'd have to hold them. Yeah. I don't. That's a big part of it. Yeah, if they don't fit and don't groove into the top of each other, then that's going to make it a lot more challenging. Let's say your grandma, Minnesota. Right, Virginia's got the five. She's trying to get it. Okay, once you get it horizontal, you got to hold it for a three count. Okay, it is close to horizontal. It is close. Okay, one, two, three. Virginia has successfully held five cans together, tying Bird's record of five. Virginia, if you could add a six can, you're going to get the win. Jaber was not able to do six. Just put one more can on the top, and if you can do it for a three count, you have beaten the bird at his own game with soda cans. Bird is looking on, definitely watching what you're doing. He's got some thoughts I can tell. Now, keep in mind, your hand cannot be touching two cans. It has to be the outward can oh my God. only. They're all bent. Uh huh. Like okay, so you tricky. think this is you think this is probably Bird's fault then? No, I think okay. that they just may not be perfect. Okay, they don't. Coke doesn't make good symmetrical <laughs> cans any longer. Okay, Virginia has got six cans going for the win. She's starting to rotate it to horizontal. If she can get it to horizontal and hold for three seconds, she's going to beat the bird. She's getting close to horizontal, close to horizontal, close to horizontal. Okay, ready? One, two, three. Count. She held it. Virginia has beat the bird. Virginia has beat the bird, was able to do six cans. Bird was able to do five. Virginia has won today's world record Wednesday challenge involving soda. Bird, what are your thoughts on this? Do you feel like you went with the wrong strategy? Do you think it might be, as Virginia said, your bitch-ass grip? What do you think happened today? Evil wins again. <laughs> That's you wanted that challenge, you took the challenge, and you got an L. Dude, my thumb hurts. Now, there are people that are calling foul on World Record Wednesday, saying that Virginia actually got her hand under the second can in when she was doing the World Record attempt, and that would uh, be a disqualification. Oh, I would never. Never. No, not our bad guy wrestler, Virginia. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now, we asked the people in the KBJ TV chat who were watching, and 63% do not believe that Virginia deserves that win. I had Suits go back and check, and Suits just showed me a still photo a second ago. I don't know if you've seen it, Danny's. But in the still shot, he believes that there is space between Virginia's palm and the Coke can, and that it was not actually touching, that maybe the angle that people saw on KBJ TV led them to believe that Virginia was touching the second can in, when in fact she was not. Look, this happens all the time to a champion. In my career of soda stacking, people have yeah. always tried to bring me down. Two things. One, I'm glad people care so much to get this involved. And then two, I don't want this win. If the witch did her little witchy ways and she skirts by with a controversial win, let her have the win. It's still a long season. There's a gap. Look at my gap. Look. Show him, Denny. That, that's, that's not also what people are. There's, there's 11,000 things they said that they're arguing about about <laughs> that competition. There's a gap. Mm -hmm. What do you think about it, uh, Denny? Taking I mean, a look at it. I filmed it from the side. It, mm -hmm. 
I mean, I think from the front angle, it does look like her palm is resting, but from the side, you can see that it's separated from that can. Yeah. It's, it's separated. Floating. You too, right. huh, Daddy? It's floating. Uh, yeah. just, I, I looked at the footage a few right. times. I Thank you, it. Danny. Okay. It. It Thank was, you for your honesty. Right. It was the Kevin and Virginia show before the KVJ. No. I know how this works. <laughs> okay. Well, for people believing that uh, it was touching and people are still saying it was resting on her palm, there's the, <sighs> the photo proof that it was not touching. That's my gap. Mm -hmm. Good job, champ. I'll yep. take it. Okay. All right. How do, how do you address that? People well, are up it's, in arms. it's controversial. <laughs>